airport, Lita. If you do have to go to the airport, check ahead. I do see a handful of flights that are either delayed or canceled. And so, uh, yes, this, this weather definitely having some consequences as well and for power outages as well. Right now, there are about 11,000 hydro customers without power right now. Most of those in the Montérégie and Montreal regions and uh, a spokesperson for Hydro-Québec says that in some sectors, uh, for example, in the NDG area where um, the, the, the power is out along Sherbrooke Street, um, Hydro says that it voluntarily interrupted service and this came at the request of provincial security officials because of the heavy rain. And so uh, it, it's not- So this thing. is of course the uh, Shaoyong uh, Xiao Yuan, sorry, R1, uh, playing around with it right now. Um, my first observations, uh, FM is nice, does well on FM. Uh, the uh, shortwave is problematic because they jammed so many frequencies in such a small space. Uh, plus the DSP tuning makes it hard to tune stations. We're gonna, you know, continue playing around with it and making videos. Um, I have did listen to some music via the Bluetooth functionality. Uh, audio quality is good. Um, could have been better, but it's good. Um, you know, if I compare it to my CNG and WFR32, the CNG is much better. Um, the problem, I think, also has to do with this central uh, control here, which is kind of moving from bass to treble if you want and it really isn't enough richness in audio to make it what it could all be you know it could be much better than that but um continue to play with it of course uh one thing i didn't know to talk about there's a small wire for an antenna that you could plug in the back because you might have noticed there's no telescopic on this radio uh, and of course it comes with a charging cable for the uh, 4,000 milliamp hour internal battery. So first observations are mostly that this is an extremely beautiful radio in a walnut wooden cabinet, uh, real wood. I mean this is absolutely beautiful in what it is and the mesh in the front is absolutely beautiful too. Uh, unfortunately, the radio side is not that great, uh, especially on shortwave. So it could serve easily as a, you know, uh, Bluetooth speaker, FM radio. It would do a decent job there, although not as good as certain other Bluetooth speakers you do have. Uh, and it definitely is a tough one on shortwave. We're going to continue playing with that but getting stations is rough and I've read a review before I actually started playing with it and uh, that review tends to point into the same direction that I'm pointing is that um, I think shortwave is there for you know added bonus but it's just not that great in performance there's a tuning light or LED here at the bottom so when you tune stations what you are hearing now is uh, CBC Radio 1 in, in Montreal on 88.5 FM uh, talking about we're having heavy rains because of uh, what's left of Hurricane Barrel, which is pounding the rain here in Montreal today and lots of road closures because of uh, water. So anyways, more to come, uh, but I you know, don't expect too much from this apart from the fact that it's absolutely beautiful. Uh, its performance does not match its beauty. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.